up everybody how's it going i just wanted to pop in here i know i haven't done a video in a rather long time or at least it seems like in a couple of months a lot's happened um i opened up my own candle shop here in my town which is amazing um i'm still working my regular job as well i'm just doing part-time um, I've got some gallstones apparently, so that's exciting. Uh, I'm going to try uh, some, it's called gallbladder cleanse. Um, I've seen amazing reviews about it. Um, so that should be here today at some point. Um, Walmart and Amazon had the whole kit. Um, there's a couple of companies like health food stores that had... Um, like they had a couple of the items because it's like four things that you take during, you know, like the morning, the night, whatever. <coughs> and so each company, like health food store wise, each company only had like this or that. They didn't have the whole freaking set. And I'm like, I don't want to buy from all these different companies and then wait for you know two weeks to get everything so amazon was actually out two weeks to get the set walmart good old walmart somehow has it and it says two-day shipping so that's what i did so i've got that coming i've got two orders from sheen um smaller sizes i'm super excited about some smaller sizes before and i can even show you my ordering before i was ordering between two and three x depending on the fabric now everything that i ordered was an extra large i am officially down 53 pounds i'm kind of at a stall so it's like i lose some i gain like two three pounds and then my period shows up and I gain three, four pounds and then I lose six pounds and it, it just goes back and forth. So I'm almost to 199 pounds and it is killing me. I'll get there eventually, but um, I'm still not working out, which I have a feeling I'm going to regret. Um, I have been working on my portion control a little bit more. I'm still eating out, unfortunately but I'm not eating out as much as that, if that makes any sense. Like going to Taco Bell, I could order like half the freaking menu and eat literally everything that I got. Now I can maybe have like, for example, like two bean burritos and a soft taco, maybe. Hang on. Have a mobile order for Jessica. For Jessica? Yep. All right, we'll have that ready for you at the window. Thank you. So, um, my family wants Taco Bell, so, um, went ahead and just put a mobile order in for us. But, anyways, so, um, but yeah, I only eat like just a couple of things, and I don't really finish everything anymore. Um, so I'm, I'm working on my portion control because I've got a feeling my coupon for Manjaro is about to end and I'm terrified because I can't spend 12, I can't spend a thousand to fifteen hundred dollars on a month's supply of shots because trust me, if I could, I would literally every month pay full price. I don't care. This medication that I was prescribed has given me my life back. Um, it has helped, it has helped so many ways. Um, I can get around a lot better. I can sleep a lot easier. Like I'm also on a CPAP machine. I haven't used my sleep. I haven't used my CPAP machine since November. Oh, sorry. I got the hiccups. Um, and my bed also, I've got a sleep number bed and it keeps an eye on like my sleep pattern and if I'm tossing and turning you know things like that and it says that I've been in like the 90 percentile 90 to 100 percent sometimes so I'm doing really good because without my CPAP before I started losing weight I would wake up with migraines I would feel like absolute shit um and 
I would be in like my like 20 to 30 percentile which is really bad it's meaning like I'm not actually getting a good deep sleep or anything um I'm gonna have to put this on pause because I'm about to come up to the window um hang on you guys could just hang out right there in my In my little door handle spot. Thank you. Wow, not friendly. Not friendly at all. Um, see, the one thing, like, I, I applaud anybody who goes to work, even if you don't like your job. Like, you're just like, I'm over this shit. I don't like my job sometimes. It is, you know, it is what it is. It's fine. However, when somebody says thank you, or, you know, they try to acknowledge you or whatever, say something back. Don't be a douchebag. Like, he's like, here's your food. Handed me two bags, one bag in each hand, and he's literally holding it by the corner. And all I could think about is $45 worth of Taco Bell food in the drive through on the drive through ground. Like, give me one bag at a time, bro. Um, but, you know, whatever. Um, but, you know, and I, I'm sure at some point they probably had a shitty customer come in and ruin their day, so they're just kind of, they're just kind of there at this point. So, I get it. I mean, I, I was yelled at all day today at my work um, by customers online, so... Um, or not online, sorry, on the phone, um, all day. So, um, I take incoming calls for credit cards, uh, different credit cards. I'm not going to share that on here because, well, you don't need to know, but, um, yeah, it was really funny. I'll tell you one, um, one guy called and he needed the payment address to, you know, where to send his payment. So I gave it to him, you know, I asked him if he needed anything else, you know, and all that. It was super nice. As I was, at, or sorry, as he was confirming the address that I had given him, he said, he is like, Philadelphia, PA. He's like, where the hell is that at in this world? And I'm like, Pen Pennsylvania 
And he was like, well, where are you getting Pennsylvania from Philadelphia, PA? And I'm like, PA is Pennsylvania, just abbreviated. He wasn't catching on. Um, so he was thinking that I was trying to have him send his payment overseas, apparently. Uh, and he said that he will look it up online because apparently I'm, you know, I'm just a liar, essentially. And he hung up. I was like, what? Like, it's literally on our statements. You'll find it online. Like, I, um, what? Sorry. Whatever. So, yeah, that's how that went. Um, there was a lot more into that. But that was the gist of the conversation. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so... And then some lady said yesterday that my voice did not sound professional. Uh, I had just got out of the hospital last weekend for a gallbladder attack. Uh, and it literally just drained me. And now I think I have either allergies or a summer freaking cold that decided to hit. So, like, my voice sounds a lot deeper and gross more than normal. It, my voice, I think, is deep anyways but it's a lot deeper like it's at least it sounds like it to me unless my ears are messed up but um she said that my voice sounds very unprofessional and um she did not want to talk to me uh and I was like excuse me what and I was like well I apologize I'm like I think I you know I think allergies hit me you know and um, obviously that can mess with your you know speaking and all that and she didn't care so um, I just noted her account and I hung up because she was being rather rude so I decided to take the high road and I told her that she was being rather rude and was not appreciated so I noted her account as such and I moved on I didn't let it ruin my day though you will have some folks that will try to go out of their way to ruin your day don't let them don't let the haters shit on your day. Like I always tell um, other customer service agents when they try to send me a bad call or a customer that's mad, they're like, you know, I'm sorry I got to transfer this over and you're the one that has it. They're like, but, you know, so-and-so is angry because of whatever reason, whatever reason it may be. And they're like, um, you know, can you help them figure out what's going on? And I'm like, well, yeah, certainly. I'm like, we're just fucking pooping up rainbows over here and um, all of that. So I'm like, yeah, I was like, I'll help. No problem. So, um, so yeah, I uh, naturally um, help them and get their situation resolved. And that's that. So now I'm home. Um, I'm going to go in, eat something, drink something. But I'm going to start doing more YouTube videos because I really miss doing that. And now that I don't have to go get the kid every day, she's there. Both my kids are out of school for summer. God help us. She tried to burn my house down yesterday. I'll tell you all about that in another video. So, yeah, this was really a pointless video. It's really just me going to go get my food. But I wanted to get this started. I wanted to get back into making videos and stuff. Just kind of like a, hey, you know, whatever. So, um, stay tuned. I'm going to probably do another one tonight. But I know I'm going to do more tomorrow, this weekend, and all that jazz. So, I will catch you guys on the flip side. I hope you guys have a fantastic... I talk a lot with my hands, so just ignore the, the hands flying around. Um, but I hope you guys have a fantastic Thursday. Happy Pride Month because today is June 1st. Um, for all of my friends out there that celebrate. Um, I've got a lot of gay lesbian friends. Um, I love every single freaking one of you. Um, no matter what you identify as, I love you. It, it is what it is. Like, I'm literally about to cry just saying that because it's true. Like... You know, it sucks that society doesn't see it as such. And some states are trying to ruin shit. It's not okay. It's not. It's not okay. 
Um, but anyways, that's going to be another video. There's so many videos that I want to do. and I'm going to take notes on every one of them. I'm going to make some like hot topic kind of things. So I hope you guys have a great day. I will see you on the next one. Bye.